girls. Some say you're the weaker sex. It doesn't mean just any guy should get a yes. Can say the reason why he sends you texts might just be to get in between your legs. Be careful, lest you fall for a devil, even if he's richer than Aliko or finer than RMD. Your best gift is still your dignity. Preserve it like an inflated balloon. If you prick it, you can't fix it in a salon. The fact that a guy has a car he drives doesn't mean he should take you for a ride. You know what I mean? All those flimsy lights, like he calls you my sweet potato pie. Uh huh. You know it's made from flour. If you yield, he'll be done with you in one hour. And then you feel so very cheap because you didn't stand your ground and quit. Guys, I sincerely hope you know that I'm not on this track to spoil your show. It just hurts to see these precious beings trading their values for worthless things, for cars, money, blink and blinks. They subject themselves to sinful things. Now when the deed is done, in the morn, your eyes clear. After the minutes of fun, why not treat them like jewels? That they are, not like the drinks that you consume at the bar. She's not a house and you the landlord. All that you do, you give account for. Besides, you gotta be careful too, because a girl can also be a devil too. Sent with the aim to distract you from seeing the bright future in front of you, huh? Yeah, now she's got cute lips, nice hips, and she flips on her hot legs, and you're thinking what you're gonna do, cause she looks too good for you to lose. Not everything that glitters will be gold. So be careful next time you're feeling cold. If you go for sex, you may lose your soul. Don't say that you were not told. I beseech you folks to present your bodies wholly acceptable, your reasonable service. There ain't need to expose your bellies just because it's displayed on the tellies. Check songs on the radio, musical videos, all they scream is sexual innuendos. That stuff called premarital sex. Sounds better as suicidal sex. Why should your fountains be dispersed abroad like throwing your substance across the floor for every drop of white that you pour? You're losing life and much more. If you sleep around all your life, what would you have left for your wife? Like slaughtering your future with a knife, it'll be your fault. It could be for life.